This is Power Time, and today I'm going to tell you about Midnight Solar's 16 string disconnecting PV combiner, or the PV16HV. Now, the 16 string configurable combiner comes in a NEMA 4X chassis and is certified six feet underwater. Now, I'm also going to show you how to hook up the SPDs, the surge protection device. I'm John, now let's get started. Midnight Solar has a new product called the Birdhouse, and it works very closely with our new line of disconnecting combiners. Joanne helped me last time show you how it works, so let's take a look. Because PV combiners are located near the power source, Midnight Solar has come up with an optional emergency shutoff switch located near the ground level, and we call this the Birdhouse. We want you to know that the Birdhouse is in constant communication with the PV combiners. And for any reason somebody comes up and they hit the red button, what it's going to do is it's actually going to tell you that the power has been turned off at the combiner and it's going to be perfectly safe for the fire department to go up on the roof. The combiner circuit breaker is open. There are still lethal voltages present between the solar panels and the combiner, which is a gray box with a red handle. Note that the handle will still be in the arm. That was really neat, John. It was actually talking to it us. It actually spoke to us. So that was the daytime version when there is power in the solar array. What's it going to say at night when there's no, no power coming in? Let's find out. The solar system has been disabled. There are no voltages coming from the solar panels. The system voltage is zero. Did you notice when I hit, when I hit the button that the, solar, the green solar on light went off and the yellow solar light off came on? That's just really neat because you, you have a visual and it already spoke to you. And also, it's hardwired into your combiner, so you're sure it's off. You're safe. Yeah. You want to remember, during the daylight hours, you're going to still have lethal voltage coming from your PV array on top down to your combiner. Midnight combiners are constructed from a heavy gauge powder coated aluminum. And they're not, they're not going to corrode, crack, or deteriorate over time. The 16 string combiner has three quarter inch conduit holes punched out for the provided three quarter to a half inch adapters. That's in case you want to run a thousand volt module wire in this 600 volt setup. Now, the 16 silicone hole plugs and the strain release are also going to be provided for this system. It's also going to come with color-coded snap-on bus bar covers. It's going to have 100 amp bus bars, two 100 amp switches, and when parallel, the bus bars are going to be rated at 200 amps. The switch connects to the birdhouse using a shunt trip circuit and a micro switch. The micro switch is going to keep track of the position the combiner switch is in, allowing the birdhouse to detect if the combiner has been shut off or not. Another feature behind our entire disco lineup is these custom clear dead fronts. The reason behind these is to stop anything from falling inside and causing an accidental short. In the 16 string disconnecting combiners, there's three different configurations that we work with. And for the lightning arresters, they're wired up just a little bit different, and I'll show you how we do that. On our parallel configuration, we've mounted our lightning arrestor up. Now on the inside, you can see the green wires coming over here to our earth ground. Now the black wire we ran across to our PV negative with the white shrink wrap on it. And the red wire we run up here to our PV positive bus bar. Here we have our non-isolated inverter configuration. And again, we already have the lightning arrestor mounted for you. But on this one, the black wire, instead of coming down here to our PV negative, what we've done on this is we run it up here to our PV negative bus bar. Now that's going to catch any kind of a surge before it comes into our switches. The red wire we've run into our PV positive bus bar, and the green wire we've run across down here to our earth ground. Now this is our two inverter configuration, and what we've done here, we've supplied one lightning arrestor, and I suggest you purchase the second one. We don't supply that one. But notice on this, there's two of everything. So our red wires are going to come into the two PV, PV positive bus bars, our black wires are going to come down to the PV negatives, and our green wires are going to come down to the earth ground. Now that we've wired in the SPDs, now let's take a look at wiring in our solar arrays. 
Now this 16 string disconnecting combiner comes in a parallel configuration, but we're going to send the parts with it for the other two configurations. And if you want a special order, we can build it here at the shop to fit your needs. The first one we want to talk about is our parallel configuration. Now this is set up for a normal transformer based inverter, up to a 28,000 watt inverter, and that's depending on your PV array. Coming from the array, the strings will be going in through these string reliefs. On the inside of your box, each string will have a positive and a negative. The positive coming out of your fuse holders will come up to two bus bars coming down to two 100 amp, 600 volt switches, which will be paralleled out to your inverter. Over here, you have your negative with the white shrink wrap coming down to your inverter too. Now from your array, the PV minus is going to be coming up to a PV minus bus bar and then out to your inverter. Again, off your array, the PV positive will be going into the bottom of your fuse holders, out the top to two PV positive bus bars, to two 100 amp, 600 volt switches being paralleled out to your inverter. This is the second configuration we want to talk about. This can handle two inverters into one combiner, and that's based off the bus bar configuration. Okay, on this configuration, it's set up to run two totally separate inverters, one for this side and one for this side. Now, when your strings are coming in, you're going to have two separate PV minus bus bars, and your PV positives will be going into the bottom of your PV fuse holders. Coming out of the top of your fuse holders, you're going to have two separate bus bars coming down to two 100 amp, 600 volt switches out to your two inverters. Over here, you have your two PV negatives going out to your inverters. Okay, let's remember we're running two separate inverters on this. So your negatives are going to be coming down going to up to two PV negative bus bars out to two inverters. The same thing with your positive coming off your arrays into the bottom of your fuse holders up to two separate bus bars down to two 100 amp, 600 volt switches out to your two separate inverters. The last version I want to talk to you about is the non-isolated inverter configuration. Now with this configuration, it's no reference to ground, so your PV positive and your PV negative both have to be fused. Now your strings will be coming in the bottom to your PV positive and PV negative fuse holders. And from the top, they'll be coming out to bus bars down to two 100 amp, 600 volt switches. Your positive will be going out to your inverter. Your negative is going to be coming over to your PV minus bus bar and then out to your inverter. Okay, coming from your array, your PV negative is going to be coming down to the bottom of your PV negative fuse holders, out the top to a bus bar, down to a 100 amp, 600 volt switch, and out to your inverter. And it's going to be the same thing with your positive. From the array, it's going to go into the bottom of your PV positive fuse holders, out the top to a bus bar down to a 100 amp, 600 volt switch, and again, out to your inverter. One of the great features about this midnight combiner is it's configurable even in the field. That means you can go straight to your dealership, purchase it off the shelf, and you're ready to go. And that's it for Midnight Solar's 16 string disconnecting combiner. Stay tuned for more videos on the disco lineup. I'm John and this is Power Time. works very closely with our disconnecting. <laughs> you think it would be so easy. And that's it for Midnight Solar's 16 string disconnecting combiner. Now stay tuned for more of the disco lineup here at Midnight Solar. I'm John and this is Power Time and I'm glad I didn't finish that last cup of coffee. <laughs> Good day.